Burnham calls for labor action against social media bullying of MPS Shadow Home Secretary Andy Burnham has called for a code of conduct to prevent bullying and intimidation of MPS. He said social media was in danger of poisoning our politics and labor leader Jeremy Corbyn had to take a firm line on it. Mr. Burnham, who voted against airstrikes in Syria, said he was concerned about abuse and threats directed at colleagues who voted for action. He said people sending such messages need to have a look at themselves. Labor MPS have complained about being sent pictures of dead babies by anti-war protesters and being subjected to abusive comments. Bad culture MPS have also been claimed they have been threatened with attempts to deselect them as labor candidates by pro-Jeremy Corbyn campaign group Momentum. Labor MP and Coffee said she was sent messages from an email account previously used by Momentum. Before Wednesday's vote, branding her a warmonger and saying she would have blood on her hands if she supported bombing. Mr. Burnham said, It makes me sad about the current state of the Labor Party that people think they can treat somebody of that long standing and experience in Parliament like an in that way. He added, There cannot be abuse by members of the Labor Party or supporters of the Labor Party. That isn't the kind of party I want to be in. He said that he, like all MPS, are expected to be held to account for decisions but do it with respect. There is a culture creeping into our politics. Social media is in danger of poisoning our politics and putting people off going into it at all, both MPS and at local level. I think it's because if you are just sitting with a keyboard you can be more offensive than if you are speaking to somebody face to face. It's a bad culture and we need to draw a line under it. Whining complaints he said talks were underway in the party to draw up a code of conduct to prevent bullying. Labor MP Chris Ryant, the Shadow Commons leader, said some of the abuse has been beyond the pale and some MPS have had their homes surrounded and offices barricaded, and had pictures of severed heads posted through their front door. MPS expect a degree of hurly early in political life, he said, but no MP should ever be intimidated and he called for a review of Commons security. Commons leader Chris Grayling said he could not discuss security arrangements but added, We are all subject to legitimate public scrutiny. But it will never be acceptable for members' personal safety to be in jeopardy. Jeremy Corbyn has called for a kinder brand of politics and has repeatedly urged an end to online abuse. And Shadow Chancellor John McDonnell, who said he had received a death threat for being opposed to airstrikes, warned that any Labour members responsible for abusive messages would face disciplinary action. The campaign group Stop the War, which until recently was chaired by Mr. Corbyn, said, Stop the War condemns the whining complaints from those MPS who apparently do not like being lobbied. If an MP is not robust enough to which stand emails and tweets, they should really not be voting for bombing other people. Those who wish to be alone with their consciences would do better to consider a life of religious contemplation. Stop the War will continue to hold to